A Fairfield woman suspected killer has been tracked down and arrested by police. The victim, Erica Brown, was reported missing last month. Investigators considered her disappearance suspicious, and they launched a search for her boyfriend, who is now behind bars. Crown Force Loop Jagal spoke with one of the victim's best friends. Nisha Criff braced for the worst late last month when her childhood friend Erica Brown did not return her or her own family's calls and texts. The 36-year-old mother was last seen at her home in Fairfield on August 20th and was reported missing to police five days later. It's really hard for me to accept what happened to her because she didn't deserve it at all. You know, I know people don't speak too much upon domestic violence, but I wish that she knew she could talk to me about it and, you know, we could have did whatever she wanted to do instead of it ending like this. Fairfield police say detectives followed leads determining Brown was no longer alive. An arrest warrant was issued for her 46-year-old live-in boyfriend, Mark Randall, who was arrested in the Sacramento area Thursday night. I thank the police department for catching him. You know, it's, this is time where you lean more on your faith because, you know, you want to do and say what you want to do, but you know in the back of your mind it's not going to bring her back. So you just try to take peace and remember the good times and things you had with her. And you just hope that justice will be served properly for her. From elementary through high school graduation, Criff and Brown grew up together. Going through life, you have your ups and downs, but we always remained in friends. And I miss her smile already. I miss her laugh. I miss doing her hair because she had beautiful hair. You know, we everybody would think it would be weave, and we're like, no, nah, that's her hair. We were best friends, but we were like sisters. Like, there was nothing... We wouldn't do without each other. Erica Brown is survived by her daughter. Police have not released a motive or cause of death. Philippe Jagal, Cron 4 News.